Hey everyone, I'm Sparky the Lightbulb, lighting up your mind with STEM power. Today we're cracking a mystery. What do forensic scientists really do? Let's welcome Freddy the Forensic Scientist. Hey Sparky, glad to be here. I've dusted for fingerprints and tested some DNA just to make it to this show. Whoa, that sounds exciting. First things first, what is a forensic scientist? Very good question. A forensic scientist uses science to help solve crimes. We analyze evidence like fingerprints, hair, or even tiny drops of blood to figure out who did what, when, and how. Um, so you're like a science detective? Exactly. But instead of chasing criminals, I chase clues in a lab coat. What kind of courses or programs do kids need to take if they want to be like you? Mark, great question. I studied biology, chemistry, and physics in high school. Then I went to college and studied forensic science. Some people take biochemistry or criminal justice programs too. So science class really matters. Big time. Also, math and critical thinking skills are super important because solving a case is like solving a tricky puzzle. Tell us about the sciencey stuff you actually do. We use biology to study DNA and hair, chemistry to test unknown substances, and physics to understand things like blood spatter or bullet angles. I also use microscopes, UV lights, and computers to analyze evidence. Hey, you just said blood spatter. Should I be worried? Not at all, Sparky. I work in a safe lab. It's more test tubes than chase scenes. Hmm. So what's a normal day like for you? I usually start by reviewing case notes. Then I test evidence. Maybe I'll match fingerprints, run DNA through a database, or examine shoe prints from a crime scene. We write reports and sometimes even testify in court. Do sounds like CSI, but with less slow motion running. Ha, ha ha, pretty much. It's slow and careful science, but very powerful. What kind of jobs can kids grow into if they love forensic science? They could become crime scene investigators, CSIs, lab analysts, toxicologists who test for poisons, or DNA specialists. Some even become forensic psychologists who study the minds of suspects. Whoa, whoa, like real life brain detectives. Final question, Freddy. What's your favorite part of the job? Easy, solving mysteries using real science. It's like being Sherlock Holmes with a microscope. And every time I help solve a case, I'm helping people and making the world a little safer. Uh, I love that. Thanks, Freddy, for sharing your amazing job. And remember, future scientists, STEM is full of exciting paths like this one. Before we go, let's see if you were paying attention. Time for a quick forensic science quiz. I'll ask the questions, and Freddy will give the answers after each one. Ready? What kind of science do forensic scientists use to analyze DNA? That's biology. We study DNA, hair, and body cells to find clues. So, true or false? Forensic scientists chase suspects through the streets. False. That's what TV shows like to show. We solve cases from the lab using science. Huh. What is one tool a forensic scientist might use in the lab? Ah. Lots of tools, but a good example is a microscope. It helps us look at tiny bits of evidence. Ah, great job, scientists in training. Give yourself a high five if you got those right. And if not, no worries. You can always rewind and learn again. Oh, thanks for joining me and Freddy today. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this with your class or family. And keep exploring, because science never stops sparking new ideas.